And Dan, this is one of the smaller projects to go before the city council. It consists of 16 new townhomes and two apartments. Tonight it was approved by the city council, but this small project, part of a larger building boom going on in the city of Marina. Drive along Imjin Parkway in Marina and no doubt you've seen the construction. New townhomes going up at the Dunes, which is all part of the Target shopping complex. That project includes more than 1,200 homes and apartments. Just up the road from there, dirt is now being moved and heavy equipment brought in for the Marina Heights project. That development lay dormant for years. The previous developer pulled out after the recession of 2008. A new builder came in and is now pulling permits for roughly 1,000 housing units. And there's more. Two other projects have been approved, Cypress Knolls and Armstrong Ranch. When those are built out, they'll add another 2,000 homes and apartments. Altogether, that's more than 4,000 housing units, bringing people and tax dollars to Marina, which was hit hard 20 years ago with the closure of Fort Orr. And then there's the Beach Town Home Apartments, which the council approved late Tuesday night. It will bring 18 new townhomes and apartments, clearly not as big as the other projects, but just as important. The project located near Reservation on Marina Road, near the heart of downtown. And we're trying to start making the downtown core of, of Marina a little bit more viable. Um, the businesses there, I think, are, you know, they're, they're, they could they need a little shot in the arm, and maybe some of these little projects like this will do that. And that developer hopes to break project, uh, rather break ground on his project this summer with a move-in date next year. Dan. All right, thank you very much, Felix. Also going up in Marina, a new hotel being built across from the Target Shopping Center. That could be completed, they say, by this summer.